I was just told something so shocking, it brought me to tears. It happened when I sat down with two of my Inside Edition colleagues to get a reading from Kim Russo, who calls herself the happy medium. I didn't start communicating to the, with the spirit world until my late 20s. But I have been seeing apparitions of entities at the foot of my bed since the age of nine. In her new book, The Happy Medium, Kim takes the kookiness out of the spirit world. People have actually said that after readings with me, they, they were able to sleep at night finally after sometimes even 20 or 30 years. When it came time for our readings, she didn't waste any time. Let's begin. Uh, as I was waiting for them to set up the lights, I kept seeing some somebody around you, two names that I kept picking up. First name is Connie. My mother. Living? <laughs> yes. Okay. Somebody's calling out to Connie. I think it's Rose. Is that, is that a connection to you? Yes. Mind? How does Rose connect to Connie, though? My mother's aunt. She's very close with her. When you sleep, your soul travels so much. So do you know when you feel like you're falling? You're falling? Oh, my God, yeah. Is yeah. that just shocking you? Yeah, because I did it last night. It's where you like, get to a cliff and then just... I feel like I'm falling when I wake up. Does the name Jean or Gina mean anything to you guys? Jean was my grandma. She's here. And what about that shocking news she told me? There's this little soul of a girl hanging around you, and she can. No, I'm okay. She's calling you mommy already. I know it may sound odd to you, but maybe not, because it seems to be resonating with you at this point. And she was right. I hadn't yet told anyone here at Inside Edition, but I am, in fact, pregnant. And it's a girl. So was it just luck or something else? I was one of those people that thought it was a little hooky and kooky many years ago. And if I didn't do this work, I don't know that I'd believe it. Oh,